I embarked on a rather ambitious project, a deep dive into the world of artificial intelligence. I spent over a hundred hours meticulously comparing and contrasting two of the leading AI models available today. It was a journey filled with late nights, countless prompts, and a whole lot of data analysis. My mission? Testing two of the biggest AIs on the market, Claude and ChatGPT. These aren't just your average chatbots, they represent the cutting edge of AI technology, each boasting unique strengths and capabilities. The goal was to push them to their limits, exploring their potential in a variety of real-world scenarios. The ultimate goal? Find out which one is actually better, more reliable, and more useful for most people in their day-to-day -day lives. There's a lot of hype surrounding AI, but I wanted to cut through the noise and provide a clear, data-driven answer. Which AI truly delivers on its promises? I didn't just ask for poems or jokes, that's the surface-level stuff. While those kinds of prompts can be fun, they don't really tell you much about an AI's true capabilities. Instead, I integrated them into my real tasks, every day. From drafting emails and brainstorming ideas to coding snippets and conducting research, I put these AIs to work on the same projects I would normally tackle myself. This allowed me to assess their performance in a practical, hands-on way. To keep things organized and ensure a comprehensive evaluation, I broke my tests into five key categories, each designed to highlight different aspects of AI performance. First, creativity, then accuracy, followed by conversation flow, then practical help, and finally, speed. To ensure a level playing field, both AIs ran side by side on my main workstation, getting the exact same prompts and instructions. This allowed me to directly compare their responses and identify any significant differences in performance. It was a true head-to-head -head competition. Throughout the testing process I meticulously tracked their strengths and weaknesses, noting down every observation and insight. I made sure to save all chat logs and notes, creating a comprehensive record of each AI's performance. This data formed the basis of my analysis and allowed me to draw objective conclusions. These aren't just smart tools. They are complex systems with their own unique characteristics. In fact, they have different personalities and quirks, which can significantly impact the user experience. Some are more creative, while others are more analytical. Some are more conversational, while others are more direct. So, what follows is my 100-hour journey, complete with real examples, data points, and surprising discoveries. We'll go through each round, examining the performance of Claude and ChatGPT in each of the five categories. By the end of this video, you'll have a clear understanding of each AI's strengths and weaknesses, so you'll know which AI fits you best and aligns with your specific needs and goals. So, without further ado, let's dive in and begin the AI showdown. First up, creativity. This is where we really wanted to see the AIs shine, to push the boundaries of what we expect from artificial intelligence. Can they truly create something original, something that resonates with a human audience? Or are they simply regurgitating information they've been trained on? To put them to the test, I asked both AIs to write a cinematic YouTube intro. The goal was to see how they would approach a creative task with a specific medium in mind. Could they understand the nuances of a YouTube audience and craft an engaging opening? The subject? The history of the floppy disk? Nostalgic? Mysterious? We wanted something that could evoke a sense of the past, a feeling of wonder and curiosity about a technology that was once ubiquitous but is now largely forgotten. ChatGPT's version was solid, it delivered a competent and well-written intro that covered the key aspects of the floppy disk's history. It started with a scene reminiscent of a dusty attic where a kid finds a floppy disk, sparking a journey into the past. The writing was clean and well-structured, easy to follow and informative. It presented the information in a logical and organized manner. But it felt a bit by the book, lacking that spark of originality that would truly captivate an audience. It felt safe, predictable and somewhat uninspired. It was good, but not surprising. It met the requirements of the prompt, but it didn't exceed expectations. Claude's take was different, it took a more unconventional approach, focusing on creating a mood and atmosphere rather than simply presenting facts. It evoked the era of dial-up sounds, the hum of a CRT, transporting the viewer back to the early days of personal computing. It was filled with vivid sensory details painting a picture of what it was like to use a floppy disk in its prime. It read more like evocative prose, a short story that captured the essence of the floppy disk experience. It was taking creative risks that paid off, resulting in a more engaging and memorable intro. ChatGPT is reliable and safe for creative tasks, providing a consistent and predictable output. But sometimes generic, lacking the unique flair that can make content truly stand out. 
Claude's writing is more nuanced and literary, demonstrating a greater understanding of language and its power to evoke emotion. It has a unique voice, a distinct personality that shines through in its writing. The risk? Sometimes it gets weird if your prompt isn't clear. It can misinterpret instructions or generate unexpected results. In this round, Claude's creative flair stood out, demonstrating a greater capacity for originality and imagination. It was a clear win for Claude in the creativity department. Now, let's delve into accuracy, an absolutely critical attribute for any AI striving for real-world application. It's not just about getting close, it's about hitting the mark consistently. In the realm of artificial intelligence, accuracy dictates the reliability and trustworthiness of the information provided. Without it, AI becomes a source of potential misinformation, leading to flawed decisions and outcomes. To put their accuracy to the test, I presented both AI models with a detailed query. I asked them to meticulously list the camera hardware differences between two flagship smartphones, the Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra and the Google Pixel 8 Pro. This wasn't a simple question. It required a deep dive into technical specifications. The challenge included identifying and comparing crucial elements, such as sensor sizes, aperture values, and the specific lens configurations employed by each device. These details are paramount for understanding the photographic capabilities of each phone. ChatGPT, leveraging its web access capabilities, absolutely nailed every single detail. It demonstrated a comprehensive understanding of the intricate camera technology. The information provided by ChatGPT was not only correct, but also remarkably up-to-date. It accurately reported sensor sizes, aperture values, lens types, and even the subtle nuances in camera hardware. This level of precision is essential for anyone relying on AI for technical information. Claude, on the other hand, managed to get the main specifications correct, demonstrating a general understanding of the subject matter. However, it stumbled when it came to the finer details, mixing up some critical information such as aperture values and specific sensor models. These inaccuracies, while seemingly minor, can significantly impact the overall assessment of the camera systems. Based on its responses, it felt like Claude was relying on older data sets, lacking access to the most recent updates and specifications. ChatGPT's key strength lies in its ability to perform real-time, reliable fact-checking, ensuring that the information it provides is current and accurate. This is a crucial advantage in a rapidly evolving technological landscape. While Claude excels at explaining complex concepts in an accessible manner, it is more prone to hallucination or missing crucial recent information, which can compromise its accuracy. Therefore, when it comes to hard data and in-depth research requiring the utmost accuracy, ChatGPD clearly wins this round, proving its superiority in information retrieval and verification. Now, conversation flow. How well does each AI remember context? I ran a long, evolving chat about planning a fictional road trip. ChatGPT started strong, adapting to changes, but sometimes forgot earlier details in longer chats. Claude, with its massive context window, remembered everything, even details from way back in the conversation. This made it great for complex, multi-step discussions. ChatGPT is quick and responsive for short to medium chats, but its memory fades in long ones. Claude excels at keeping track, though sometimes replies are a bit slower. For deep, ongoing conversations, Claude has the edge. Practical help, summarizing articles, drafting emails, organizing projects. I gave both a dense article to summarize and asked for a professional email sharing the summary. ChatGPT was fast, clear, and concise. Perfect for productivity. Claude's summary was more nuanced, capturing subtle points and its email felt more human and natural. ChatGPT's output is efficient but can feel generic. Claude's is richer and more personal, though sometimes wordier. For everyday tasks, both are excellent but Claude's nuance gives it a slight edge, especially with long documents. Last round, speed. I fired off dozens of quick questions and tasks to both AIs. ChatGPT 4.0 was nearly instant. Answers appeared as soon as I hit enter. Claude is fast but just a fraction slower, especially in rapid-fire exchanges. For longer, complex tasks, the speed difference is minor. But if you want instant responses for quick tasks, ChatGPT is the clear winner. After 100-plus hours, here's my verdict. Claude wins on creativity and conversation flow. ChatGPT leads in accuracy and speed. For practical help, it's almost a tie. Claude is more nuanced, ChatGPT is more efficient. If you're a writer, student, or researcher working with long documents, Claude's context window and creative style are game changers. 
For most people though, ChatGPT is the best all-around tool fast, accurate, and versatile. Try both for free and see which fits your workflow, but if I had to recommend one for the average user, it's ChatGPT, polished, reliable, and powerful. That's been my experience. If you found this useful it would help us a lot if you gave us a like and subscribe to our channel, thank you.